Mike hates it when I do that. He hates it, so that's why I'm going to carry on doing it. It's my thing now. So today we're going to do another full day of eating. It's been a little while since we've done one. We're going to go over roughly 16 to 1800 calories a day. I'm going to try and stick on the slightly lower end of that. We're going to try and mix it up and have some things that maybe you've not seen us have before, uh, just to prove to you all that we do flexible diet and we don't just stick to the same boring stuff all the freaking time. So hopefully you get some good meal ideas from this. I'm going to dive in now. I'm going to make Spanish beans, eggs, cheese, and bacon for breakfast. calories, uh, 40 grams of protein. Uh, it's not a huge amount of food on my plate. It could have more veg and that if I wanted with it. But I really like this. It's a little bit different. Uh, if you've got a bit of time in the morning, it's really nice to make. You can make it with a full pack of the beans and it obviously goes a little bit further, but you obviously have more calories with it. I think it's an extra 140 calories for the half the pack. I really like this breakfast. Really, really enjoy it. Vitamin C and zinc in there. I'm feeling a little bit ill at the moment. And I've been missing that out for the last couple of weeks. So make that what you will. And then obviously my supplements there, supplements that work. So omega-3, vitamin D, multivitamins. So that's my breakfast. I'm gonna chat down on this and then as usual, we're gonna go and head over to Mike's and see what he's made for breakfast. He's probably gonna make some sort of shit joke as well about me and how I can't eat or how I've not no muscle or something like that. But he can't even use a fucking camera. So he's not really one to be talking, is he? That's about 1800 calories, I'd say. Is that your breakfast, is it, mate? There's nothing else in the fridge, mate. <laughs> there, is no, there is actually nothing else in the fridge. There's nothing else in the fridge. So, room not to. It's been my birthday. Happy birthday, Mike. Thank you. Happy birthday. It'd be rude not to waste it, wouldn't it? So, what's on there then? No, no, it's, got, it's got Oreos, cookies, white chocolate with crisp, cookie crisp, white chocolate, cookie dough balls, Maltesers, and white chocolate over the top with and like an Oreo biscuit base. A base of cheesecake. And it's cheesecake. Mm. That, so is, really that is that is thick, isn't it? Mm. It's thicker than Jay Goody. Eight hundred calories, is it today? It's got to two thousand just with that. Mm. Not even getting a plate out. Why would you? Why bother? Why bother? This ain't lasting all day. So you're now going to see in a uh, full day of eating on a cheat day. That's what you're going to see today. Should I? Should I? You might as well just go fuck it now. Should I? Go, fuck it. That's what everyone else would do, innit? Fuck it. Mm. Really human. Fuck it. Should I genuinely do? I've not had the best weekend for food. Yeah. I've had a great weekend all that. Give them something to watch, do you know what I mean? I might as well give you something to watch, guys. Sure. I'll stick to a normal day, and Mike can just go to town today. <laughs> Why not? We definitely need a refeed day after you, this weekend. You do need a refeed day, mate, I think. It's only your birthday once a year, though, isn't it? So, 12 weeks out, guys. <laughs> only human, aren't we? Enjoying that, aren't we? Yeah. This is a good breakfast. <laughs> if I eat enough, there'll be enough protein in the cream cheese, mate. That's true. <laughs> so there you go, guys. Breakfast. Breakfast. Done right. Cheers, guys. <laughs> How's your diet going, mate? Yeah, fantastic. I'm just having my pre-workout, um, thousand grams of carbs in cheesecake and cereal form, you know, as you do. Are they good, though? Very good. See, they're in the roulette ones, aren't they? Yeah. You can't buy solely the white chocolate ones. And we all know the white chocolate ones are the best ones in the roulette. So a full box is fucking heaven. Thank you, Danny, and thank you, Ben. Is that mine, is it? Yeah. Ladies first, isn't it? Nice, isn't it? That's nice, mate. Thanks, yeah. Ladies first. Pour it in two glasses, then you put in. I'm going to. I've only got one shake, that's the thing. Fucking hell. That's why I've done it. Ooh. It's not come out very smooth, has it? I thought it'd be a lot smoother than that. Smooth focus. Clean. Clean focus. When people are saying clean focus, right? Or oh, you get a real clean focus. By the definition of the term focus, it means that you must be focused. Yeah. It's foggy focus, it's not How, focus. It wouldn't be focus no. if it if it wasn't clean, if it was mm. foggy, if it was cloudy, if it was dirty, then it it's juxtaposition. Like, how do you determine what clean focus and what unclean focus is? Oh, you get a real clean focus on this. Ugh, clean focus. What you mean is not jittery, or like, not overstimulated. Is that, is that what they I mean? I think that's what they mean. I think that's what they mean. So yeah, what I've had today is I've had that breakfast today, um, and then we're just having this pre-workout. I'm not too hungry at the moment, because I had a little bite of cheesecake, didn't I? 
So that that sustains me for about three hours. My diet's gone to shit, let's <laughs> be honest. You're, we're considering Mike having a 10 calorie, 10,000 calorie cheat day today. No, I mean, no, you no. might as well just go for it. Uh, we'll see. You might as well write off till tomorrow, that's what they all do, isn't it? That's what, what they're supposed do. to do. Right, that's what they're supposed tomorrow. to do. No, we'll see, we'll see what we're getting for lunch. To be honest, like that cheesecake, it's not really going to send me fucking waves anyway. No. And it's too good, not, it's too good. It's, it's too, too good. good. Like, it's not even like it's a, a Waitrose cheesecake, is it? That's just, no. you know, standard one. Like, I wouldn't is. have gone out and bought it, like, it's for my birthday, so it's like, well, sometimes you just do that. Do that, don't you? Just, you just, just do stuff it. like that, mate, yeah. <laughs> But I'll probably just get a chicken salad for lunch if I'm being totally honest. Yeah, I might not have a halo top tonight, so that will probably balance out somewhat of the cheesecake I probably had maybe about. Of the sick of the cheesecake you've eaten. Well, today, I probably just had 500 today. calories from cheesecake. Yeah, true. Cheers, mate. Yeah. We won't try and down it again because it wouldn't happen last time. No, it's embarrassing. We don't want to... This top's already dirty, look at it, mate. The only reason he bought a new top, by the way, was because his other one was dirty, dirty and he couldn't bother to clean it. Why? Don't forget if you want your own. The link's in the description. It is in the description. If you want one, you want one. If you don't, you don't. Yeah. Who wouldn't want our faces on their back? Who wouldn't, mate? Yeah. Imagine yeah. having me and Dan on your back. Picture that. <laughs> don't have to picture it. OnlyFans account. Ain't you seen OnlyFans account? No, you got one. No. Well, I've been asked to make one. Do you know what they are? It's like you yourself like, like a webcam. Yeah, and you just like... And you just be naked for money. Yeah. Why not? Why would you not do that? Why would I not? <laughs> one viewer, one dirty old man. Money in the bank. Money in the bank, yeah. Money in the bank, man, take it. Man's got to eat. He'd probably ask for a refund, I reckon. <laughs> I reckon he would. Anyway, so we have to go and train now. Are we doing legs? No, we'll do back and arms instead. We'll back do legs arms. on Thursday or Friday. Mainly because I don't want to get changed into my shorts. <laughs> I'm that lazy. Yeah. It's fine, though. You can, it's flexible training. You can move it around. Flexible training, yeah. Just do back, back and arms, chest and delts. <laughs> it's fine. So we'll see you. So for lunch, I've got balanced for you M&S mac and cheese. Controversial choice. Plant-based though, so all good. It's not vegan, cheese. mate. Plant-based, told you. Plant it's got cheese in it. What uh, plant's and then, in it? What plant's in that? But, uh, what plant is it? It's got mushrooms and spinach in it. Right, got. It's got high protein with balanced carbs. I've got balanced carbs. And one of those for You've after. got to balance your carbs, haven't you? I've got some Mexican style chicken. M&S, that's really good. I look really short at the moment, I don't yeah. like it. I'm just on my tiptoes. And honey and roast ham. And I'm just frying off some mushrooms and some onions and I'm going to put it with some frying salad. Ainsley. Yeah. Um, frying them off. That's so I've had enough. I've had enough. We've got a bit more cheesecake to finish though, yeah. haven't we? And I'm also going to have one of these because Dan reckons that this is the best non-chocolate protein bar. It is. It is. Have a guess why I like this angle. You stay there, right? Because you're about 10 foot further forward. Right, Battle Bites. So I had tried one of these yesterday uh, and I told Mike straight away he needed to try one, so he's trying it now. 220 calories, so the same as like a carb killer or whatever. Yeah. 20 grams of protein, only 8 grams of fat. Split into two as well, it's, I quite like that. It's about the same macros as a, as a carb killer. Yeah, it's pretty is, yeah. much bang on. I love the way he closes his eyes as well. It reminds me of when we were in bed together. <laughs> now I said this is the best non-chocolate protein bar I've ever had. This is very good. How good is that? It tastes like jam, mate. That is very good. You need to get one of these. Miles better than a carb killer birthday cake. It's that jam. Mm. It actually tastes like birthday cake. What? Out of ten? Easily a nine. Nine? Come on, mate. Don't shoot your load. It's on a par with hazelnut nougat better. Nougat? That's what they say, nougat. What? Well, that's what they call it, nougat. Who, what do you mean, what they call it? <laughs> Who's they? Everyone. No. Nugget. Is it nugget or nougat? Nugget. Nougat. We can't even ask them what their opinion is because they're just going to spell it. <laughs> <laughs> right below nougat, nougat. <laughs> Do you agree with Dan that it's nougat or Mike nugget? Nougat. It's not nougat. It's not. I bet you say everything. Hello. Say hello. hello. Have you got your light on? Yeah. Yeah. Back. You're going. I don't need to see you anymore. Doesn't need to see me anymore. I've got a cricket now and I'm not gonna be able to eat anything decent before I go, so I reckon it's gonna have to be another protein bar. Cricket's obviously not a hugely strenuous sport, so I don't need like loads and loads of calories. But it's gonna be until like what? 
half eight, nine o'clock till I have some dinner. Oh, it's fucking zoomed in again. <laughs> it's fucking zoomed in again, seriously. And it's not even fucking, what the fuck? It's blurry as anything. Damn, this is fucking wank again, isn't it? I can't fucking do this, Dan. Like, all of these diagonal lines as well. Like, why are all these diagonal lines on it? Something to do with the brightness, this little wheel here. I look a fucking dickhead in a vest and all, don't I? Where's my hair? Shit. Right, so, that's fucking, I know he's gonna, I know he's gonna keep it in, that's the thing. I know he's gonna keep it in. In a quest for better lighting, I've found a different house. And what I had in the car, I didn't show you that I picked up from the petrol station. I had like a packet of turkey, and that's it. And a Ribena, because Ribena's nice. And here, I've got fucking one-up plate. <laughs> fucking hell, he's red hot. Fuck's sake, why do I always fuck it up? I've got chicken and stir-fried veg cooked in soy sauce and garlic, some butternut squash waffles with some chip spice on top, which apparently, if you're from all, is a thing. Yeah, I'm not in Hull, by the way. <laughs> Just put that out there, Jesus Christ. My life's not gone that down now. Um, and then some bare naked rice. So that's the rice with like fuck all calories in it. And again, I've cooked that in as much as I could to get rid of the actual taste of it. Because it's not great, I'll be honest. But um, it all goes to make a turd. I've cooked in like soy, garlic, chilli and all that shite. Again, quite a low calorie meal because obviously I had cheesecake for breakfast, which is never good. Um, especially on a diet. But yeah, so the lighting is better in here though. The lighting's better, way better. But I just look a mess. Like... Look how sweaty I am, it's red hot in this kitchen. So hopefully this is all right, Dan. I'm better than usual, I think it's better than usual. But I don't know if you're gonna be able to use it with all them diagonal bits on it. You've talked about it before, but I don't, don't really listen. So you're gonna use all this, I know you are. So if you've got in from cricket, protein is a little bit low because I've had a couple of protein bars today and obviously for the calories that's in them, there's not a huge amount of protein. So I've got 200 grams of chicken in a wrap with protein cheese. It's like 9 p.m. I go to bed about 10. I don't need loads of veg to pad it all out. Probably could do, uh, but I've drunk enough water today and all that sort of stuff, so I don't feel too bad actually at the moment. I'd usually feel quite hungry about now. Calories at 1,655. However, I did have full disclosure a few little bits of chocolate things off the cheesecake that Mike was eating this morning. So it's probably an extra 250, 300 calories, so call it 1,900. But still, on a day, 1,900 calories, I don't feel particularly hungry. But then at the weekend, I had a little bit more food. I had um, a couple of days where I went up to maintenance calories, so it's probably why. Scales haven't really gone up a huge amount. I'm still around 77. Cricket is a real man's sport. Don't you worry about it. Mike will tell you otherwise. But then again, he can't use a camera, can he? So who's the moron? You just turn it on and point it. It's not really that difficult. And just turn the light on. Don't forget, don't forget to turn the light on. Overall today, like I said, had a ready meal. Uh, breakfast this morning was really decent, to be fair. Uh, had a couple of protein bars. So not ideal, but again, like life isn't ideal. Uh, things get in the way. Things crop up, like I said, with cricket and all that sort of stuff. I just had to grab things on the go today. It's never been perfect, but... It gets the job done, you hit your calories, hit your macros, you do what you need to do. I'm sure that Mike has fucked up somewhere along the way with his dinner and with his filming. Um, and no doubt he's probably filming in complete darkness. Let's go find out. My usual, even though I'm not in my own house. Massive tub of Greek yogurt, like too much of anything, to be honest. It's probably gonna give me stomach ache. 10 calorie jelly, frozen raspberries, and a bit of granola on top for some crunch. Pretty boring. Although to be fair, I've had quite a big cheesecake, haven't I? So I suppose. You might have got off on that, you little pervert. This week, probably, I, keep, I say this every fucking week, this week's not been the best for dieting. Hopefully next week will be better. Not eating that many calories in total for a man, a man of my stature. Anyway, at least the lighting's better this week. I might just start doing it from here. Yeah, so I will start dieting at some point. This series will be taken slightly more seriously by me. Dan's trying his hardest. Bless him, bless him. So 12 weeks until our first photo shoot. Maybe 18 weeks before our last photo shoot. I'm gonna leave it there, because I'm, I'm boring myself. <laughs> Never work with idiots, is what Dan usually says to me, and I think I'm saying it this time, because there's one in the room. You don't, none of you know who it is. So who is it? Mystery, suspense. If you can have a guess, put it below. You'll never guess. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs>